Hey guys, welcome back to another video. Hope you're all doing well. Today is Saturday, 15th of January, and yeah, guys, it's currently half 10. Um, I'm only after waking up. I'm literally just after getting back into bed for a few minutes because obviously, hopefully, I'll be going streaming the um, Chelsea game, Chelsea Man City. But I'm thinking, is Man United Aston Villa a bigger game? I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, basically it's half ten anyways. I put on the telly in the background. Fast and Furious 7 is on. So um, I'm going to watch that for a little bit. So uh, yeah guys, I hope you enjoyed this video. If you do, please smash a huge thumbs up. And if you're new, please do subscribe. And yeah guys, I've just been in the real mood to play FIFA again. And I'm like, what the hell? Like, I'm never in the mood to play FIFA. And I'm sorry that the lighting's really bad and it's dark in here. As I still have my curtains closed. And it's the exact same in yesterday's video. And I'm sorry about that. But, um, yeah, guys, that's basically all I've said. Hope you enjoy. If you do, please smash a huge thumbs up. And if you're new, please do subscribe. And, yeah, guys, basically, now I'm just going to lie here for about a half an hour, maybe an hour. So I'm not embarrassed to be down at the moment. I'm just lazy, to be honest with you. Um, because I didn't get the greatest night's sleep. So I'm going to relax. So, yeah, guys, that's basically all I've said. Um, I'll talk to you in a little bit when I get up get dressed and have my breakfast so yeah guys i'll talk to you guys then all right guys so it is currently 5 to 12 sorry about staying my hair but um yeah guys i've decided i'm not going to stream the ars or the man city chelsea game i'm actually going to stream man united later on as like it's closer in the table between the two in the sense of that either team could finish higher than each other um depending on the way the season goes but this game um, I'm going to talk about it on this vlog instead, um, just to make something a little bit different. Why the hell not? Um, and obviously, we, we're not sure if the Arsenal Tottenham game is going to go ahead tomorrow, so that's going to be an interesting one to see whether that game does go ahead or not. But um, yeah, it's definitely going to be a tough game for both teams here. It's going to be very, very uh, even compared to other games that have been played this season. Um, very two talented teams that are coming up against each other. Um, either team could win, let's be honest, but if we're betting people, you probably put Man City as favourites, but again, you never know, so yeah guys, that's basically all I would say, I'm going to play a game or two of FIFA, because it's currently just 12 o'clock now, so I have time to play a game or two of FIFA, and yeah guys, that's basically all I would say, I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. So, okay, so the Chelsea, um, Man City game is just about to start. Um, I'm going to say it's going to be a City win, so maybe 2-1 City, but Chelsea could easily win this game, it's after kicking off now, but uh, yeah, I could easily see Chelsea win this game, but you know, you never know, I'm going to be playing FIFA as well, I actually won a game, let's go. But, uh, yeah, guys, that's basically all I've said. I'll talk to you if there's a goal, an update, anything like that. So, yeah, guys, I will talk to you in a bit. Alright, guys, so sorry now. It's actually a lot later. It's currently 25 to 5 in the evening. So, guys, I'm going to go to the Man City Chelsea game. It was a 1 0 win for City. Very good result from City. It was a De Bruyne goal. Um, not sure actually who got the assist for Cancelo. Yeah, so Cancelo is a good show for FPL, by the way, guys. If you haven't even thought of getting them yet, um, yeah, it's pretty much one dimensional. City it was all City, pretty much like City were the better team 56% possession compared to 44, 11 shots, 6 on target for Man City, only 4 shots for Chelsea, with one of them being on target, you know. So, both teams had one big chance and they missed them. I'm currently watching Good Morning Football Weekend as, um, I was actually out in the kitchen for a bit, so I'm only after coming back in. So I'm going to have a quick look here at the games that are currently going on. Newcastle are beating Watford 1-0. Norwich are beating Everton 2-1. And Wolves are beating Southampton 2-0. So, yeah, the goals for Southampton. Raul Jimenez and Connor Cody. Norwich, <clears throat> let's see. Michael Keane on goal. Alameda, let's go. And Richarlison got one back. And Newcastle are beating Watford 1-0. So, 
San Maximan, no surprises there. And obviously, guys, the Arsenal game has been called off. Don't know. Means we'll have a fully strength team now playing Tottenham. Don't know whether that's a good or a bad thing because, you know, um, what was I going to say? Son could be back by then, but anyway. He got an, he picked up an injury at training or something. Uh, Byron Beck Cologne 4 0 today. Hurts of Berlin 1 2 1 against Hoffenheim. Mainz bet Bochum 1 0. Uh, RB Leipzig got a 2 0 win over Stuttgart. And Wolfsburg Hurts uh, ended 0 0. Bayern Leverkusen and Borussia Mönchengladbach are playing there in a bit. Um, so, yeah, guys, I'm going to keep an eye on these games. There's only about, in the Prem, there's about 10 minutes left in them, each of them. I'm not going to be streaming the game. I just don't really feel <laughs> great. I don't feel up to it. I'm just tired and lazy, to be honest, guys. But I will be watching the game. Um, I will talk to you guys about the game. And, uh, yeah, obviously, I'm going to be watching some of the NFL, hopefully, tonight. Watch a film with my family. And, uh, yeah, guys, that's basically all I would say. I hope you're enjoying the video so far. Um, pretty disappointed the Arsenal game has been postponed tomorrow. But what could be done? You know, uh, there's two 2 o'clock kickoffs instead. There's Leeds West Ham and there's Liverpool Brentford. And I mean, me as an Arsenal fan wants to see Arsenal play. And obviously, we got a good nil nil draw there at the weekend, and I'm I'm happy about it. But at the same time, you kind of are disappointed because you want to see your team play as often as possible. But I mean, there's still some good games going on and. That Man City Chelsea game, even though there was only one goal, Man City looked very comfortable, and it was. I'm glad I didn't actually stream it in the end because it was very low scoring and just it was a bit cagey at times during the game, especially when a few times Chelsea kept Man City out. Yeah, it was just mad. Foden again, brilliant performance. Like, what can you say? Phil Foden is a great young player, so. Again, Grealish, get him out of that team. Get him out. Like, how is he good enough to be even in this team? I don't know. This Man City team is a top team. I don't think he's good enough. Where's the 100 million? They used the oil money, but they didn't use it very well. Personally, I just don't think... I just think they could have spent money better. On a better player than Grealish and spend less. But that's just my opinion. So yeah guys, um, there's some interesting games on in the NFL as well tonight. Obviously the Bengals and the Raiders are playing. And then the Bills and the Patriots. And then tomorrow there's Tampa Bay and the Eagles and Dallas and the 49ers on tomorrow night. Going to be very, very good games. We'll see how they go, you know. Um... So yeah guys, that's basically all I've said at the moment. Um, I'm going to go do a couple of bits. The Aston Villa game is on in about 50 minutes. So got to get what I need to get done there quickly. It uh, shouldn't take me too long to do. So yeah guys, that's basically all I would say. I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. Alright guys, so it is currently half time in the Man United Aston Villa game. It is 1-0 to Man United. It was... Um, it was actually uh, Martinez' mistake. Um, and yeah, that's what has Aston Villa 1-0 down. Um, Aston Villa have looked really dangerous though when they've been on the ball, even though they've had less possession with 45%. They've had four shots with three on target, which is very, very good. Um, but Diaz has actually been very good. I think has been the best player on the pitch, to be honest with you. Um, yeah. Bruno has a 7.5, but that's because he scored the goal. I think Wendy has been the best player on the pitch. With De Gea, De Gea has made a couple of good saves as well. But, yeah, like that's pretty much it. Like, Coutinho's definitely going to be coming on. He's making his debut today, for anybody that doesn't know. He's after coming. I think it's only on loan he is. Um, let me see. Yeah, he's only on loan till the end of the season. But still, like this is a really, really good signing for Aston Villa. Could do a lot for him. So, yeah, it's going to be interesting to see how they get on with him. So, yeah, guys, basically, um, 
I'm going to be getting my dinner in a few minutes, so I probably won't get to watch, watch the whole game, which is fine. Um, and then I'm just going to be spending some time with my family. So yeah, guys, that's basically all I'd say at the moment. Um, yeah, I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. Alright guys, it is currently 20 past 10. So yeah guys, basically I'm going to head out, spend some time with my family. We're going to watch something. And yeah guys, that's basically all I'm going to be up to for the evening. I hope you're enjoying the video so far. Uh, yeah, the Bengals are currently beating um, the Raiders 10 tree. So yeah, it's been an interesting game so far. So yeah guys, that's basically all I would say. I'll talk to you in a bit when I, um, when I come back in. So yeah, I'll talk to you guys then. Alright guys, it's currently 2am now. Um, the buff, the build, builds are playing <laughs> the New England Patriots, and they're winning the Buffaloes, fourteen 0 at the moment. So, yeah, I'm not sure how the other game went because I was out spending some time with my family. But yeah, I guess that's basically all I would say. I'll talk to you properly in a minute. All right, guys. So the Bengals bit the Raiders twenty six nineteen, which means they're progressing. Uh the Bills are beating the Patriots currently fourteen nil, but they're on the drive here so they're uh first and goal here so yeah guys basically i'm just gonna watch this for a while it's currently just after two o'clock so yeah guys that's basically all i have to say if i don't talk to you in a little bit i'll talk to you guys in the morning but either way i'll talk to you guys then